Snaps are a feature that forces a click point to a certain alignment. Snaps can be used drawing patterns and boundaries using the mouse, or if you have a touch screen, you could use your finger. They can also be used for draw tools, trim, and moving your patterns. Creative Studio has two different types of snaps. We have the grid point and the end point. I need to draw a boundary on the CAD screen. So I'm going to select the boundary icon, or I could use a shortcut alternate B on the keyboard. Down in the bottom left corner of the screen is a G and an E. We'll start with a G. If I click on that G, I activate the grid point snap. Now when I move the cursor over to the screen, it snaps to those grids. And you hear when I approach a corner, it snaps. I'm going to show you how to draw a boundary using the grid snap on the screen. I'm going to left click, left click, left click, left click. A right click closes that drawing, and another right click can get you out of that draw mode. Now I'm going to show you how to move a pattern. When we're in the Pattern Anchor Edge Mode, F9, I can move that pattern. Now I want to snap that pattern to grid. To do that, I have to go back to Draw, Anchor Point, End Point, and F11 will, will also make that work. Now I can snap that to grid. That's good to snap the grid if you want to make sure this is on a horizontal plane. Okay, now if I want to snap to the up to the end point, I go to end point, snap, move this to the nearest end point. See, it snaps right to that. Now you can turn on the grid snap with the G key on the keyboard and the E the end point, it can be turned on with the E key on the keyboard. Whenever you approach an end point, it will snap to that. Whenever you click that, left click, you hear a pop. That means we've selected that. So I can go to the other end point, hear the snap, now you hear the pop. That demonstrates the snaps.